Hey, if, what, do you if, know how to if, put a ten? Hey, 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 if I prove you wrong, you have to smack yourself in the face ten times on camera. How about that? Okay. How about that? Hello. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome to our eating show. My name is Daniel, and this is my lovely girlfriend Nikita. You're not allowed to call me that. Why? Daniel's been calling me Nikita lately. It's so weird. I'm not allowed to call you by your name. But it's just weird. <laughs> Because usually if I say Nikita, it's because I'm like angry or something. Yeah, like right? did I do something or... <laughs> no, but like, what, what am I supposed to call it? I'm introducing us and the video, okay? Just, just I chill, okay? Okay, but my name is Nak. It's not Nikita. Just... Nobody calls you Nak. Actually, they do. What? Who? It, okay, no one calls you Dan. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. People call me Nak all the time. Who calls you Nak? Everyone, all Who's... my friends. You don't have any. My mum. Not jokes. Anyway. <laughs> KFC came out with some $8 buckets, but mm. they didn't come in buckets, unfortunately. I'm so sad. But uh, they had a few different ones. They had a uh, Wicked Wing one. Wicked Wings, which we got Wicked Wings. We got Wicked Wings. Ob obviously original recipe. Tenders. Tenders. And nuggets. Nuggets. We didn't get the nuggets or the tenders because I feel like we got the tenders. That'd be overkill. Nikita was gonna get the tenders yeah. and Wicked Wings and not original recipe. And I was like, you can't go to KFC and not get original recipe. That's just crazy. I can. That's just, that's just silly. But we think we've hacked it because normally original recipe is so inconsistent. Sometimes it's so dry and gross and I don't want to risk it. So today we've asked for only the dark meat parts of the chicken and mm, they're delivered. I mean, that hack. is a hack. It's not a hack, is it? Yeah, ask for no breast. Um, these might possibly be the worst chips I've ever had at any fast food place. My first chip was good, but I think they've just gone a bit stale. These are truly terrible chips, but anyway. Yeah. I'll still eat them. Yeah, I'll still eat them. Today's not really about the food, although it is... How good does it look though? Eight dollar buckets. We we're about to order Malaysian food and then KFC app sent me a notification that was like eight dollar buckets today and I was like... Hmm. You want yeah. <laughs> and I've been wanting to do a KFC um, video. Oh, really? Yeah, I have. Is this enough food for you? Would you have wished to get Man, more? This is plenty of food. Are you kidding? Okay, good. Well, today, we're actually going to play a game. We're going to do a relationship quiz mm -hmm. and see how well we know each other. Let's try, I'm going to try a Wicked Wings. Is that all right? Yeah. Oh, man. Crunchy. Oh, that's good. You know, I don't know why they make the Wicked Wings so crispy and the original recipe not crispy. Is that just weird to you? Like they know how to make crispy chicken, but they just choose not to make crispy original recipe, which I find really weird. That's why I like Wicked Wings. They're just so much crunchier. I think Wicked Wings are just as good as original recipe. Yeah. Anyway, enough about the KFC. Okay. On to the question. First question is their birthday. Easy. Yeah, is it? 23rd of September. And what year? 93. You know. You actually thought I wouldn't know that? Yeah, maybe not. Are you serious? Yours is the 16th of April. <laughs> How good was that joke? The 16th of August, 95. Yes, there is. What is my age and your age? What, what was the point of that? We just did our date of births. Yeah. What kind of list is this? <laughs> are you good at math? You are 20... You're 25? I don't even know sometimes. I what don't even know what, my own age. How old am I turning this year? 26. Yes. I mean? You're 28. Damn, you're old. Oh my God. Remember the time you thought you were 27? Yeah, I thought I was 27. You literally aged yourself. Yeah, I told somebody, somebody asked how old I was. I told them I was 27. I didn't realize I wasn't. What is this? I don't know, black stuff. I see weird shit in KFC. I don't question it. It still tastes good. Okay. But that is the... Did you come up with this list? No, I saw it online. Birthday, date of birth, and then how old are you? What the I hell? saw it online. I kind of thought the same thing. Anyway, my... Well, the zodiac sign. Mm -hmm. Not Chinese zodiac. Zodiac. What's that called? Astrology. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I think so. You are a Leo. Oh! Are you okay? No, yeah. <laughs> oh man. You're a Leo. I know what you are, but I just kind of like have a brain fart. Yeah, that's why it's like you could easily Google it. 
and you were home all day, I went to work and I was like, I'm not trusting him at home all day and he's not going to Google it. You see, where you mess up is you think I care. <laughs> Why would I, I, I don't care enough to Google this. I thought you'd want to win. You love to win this kind of stuff. Anyway. What's the answer? Um, damn, what are you again? Did you even know you were a Leo? Yeah, I knew I was Leo. Oh, okay. Wait, I didn't even know the zodiacs though. Can you can you just name the zodiacs for me? And I, I can tell you which one you are. I just don't even know them. There's like Pisces, yeah. Aquarius, Taurus, Sagittarius, Virgo, Leo, you're Virgo. Libra. Oh, Libra. Cancer. <laughs> no, you're Virgo. Final answer, you're Virgo. That's a final? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> what are you again? Wait, can you name all of them? Name all of them. Is there 12? How many is there? There's 12, yeah. Uh, is it 12? I'm not sure. Okay. Leo, Taurus, Sagittarius, Pisces, Gemini. You're not any of those. What did I say? I Leo, Taurus, Sagittarius, yeah, Pisces, yeah, no. Gemini, Virgo, no. Libra, Cancer, Scorpio. You're definitely not Scorpio, I know that. Wow, I know so many though. Yeah. But I don't know the full list. You're either a Virgo or Libra, but I'm going to lock in Virgo. Yes, what? I'm right. No. I'm oh. wrong. I'm both. Oh, yeah, well... But you you consider yourself a Virgo, right? That's what... No, I kind of go both. I'm more a Virgo because I feel like I'm really organised. See? But See? when I read the star signs, I relate to a Libra because my birth date is on the cusp of it. So I'm literally both. It depends where you are in the world. Oh, so I was like double correct. Yeah, kind of. Damn, I'm good. <laughs> you are good. Um, oh, the next one. I need zodiac sign. I don't know the answer. I'm so annoyed. My one's so easy, but you're a rooster. I am a rooster. Are you a rat? Nah. You're, you're gonna, the one. Oh. You're gonna kick yourself when you find out what I am. Is it a pig? Well, you have to tell me the answer now. You gotta lock in an answer like I did. So it's not a rat. Could be a rat. My answer definitely is. My answer definitely is. You're the one that came last in the race. But what that one is, is probably a, a pig. No, it's not a pig. What other ones are there? What Real? else is there? No, snake. I think there's a snake. Not a snail. I don't, no, there's no snail. Just lock one in, player. Oh, this is hard. Come on, man. Rabbit. Pig. Rabbit. Dude, we got to move on to the question. You know we got a lot of questions. <laughs> okay, rabbit. I am a pig. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. No, you didn't. You said rabbit, so you didn't know it. But at the start, didn't I say pig? No, at the start I said rat. Never mind. <laughs> See, isn't that obvious? Like, I'm, I'm a pig. What, in life? No, it's just like easy to remember. It's funny. That you're a pig. Yeah. Okay. Favourite TV show. This is a bit easier. For you, uh -huh. I wrote One Piece. No. Or something anime. No, I don't watch One Piece, so you, you you automatically lose. Yeah, you do. What are you talking about? Naruto. I don't watch. No, I don't. Naruto. No. No. Um, the volleyball. Dude, one. you've had like three guesses already. <laughs> well, what's mine? Uh, you have three options. It may have changed recently because you don't really watch it anymore. But I mean, across your life, if we take your whole life into consideration, it would have to be Grey's Anatomy. Oh, what? It would have to. Nah. If you take your whole life, like... But I've not watched every episode. I know, but like... But these other shows on my list, I've watched every single episode. Okay, well then, The Real Housewives then. Yeah, that was one of them. Or yeah. Vanderpump Rules or Below Deck. Yeah. I know yours. Scrubs. No. <sighs> it's easy. Simpsons. No. Family Guy. No. Is it a cartoon or no. anime? It's easy. Yeah. It's super easy. Basketball? <laughs> uh. How often do you watch it? Lucifer? I haven't watched it in a while, but I, it's probably the series that I've watched the most. Like I've probably rewatched oh. the series 10 plus times easy. Friends. Yeah. You don't get that. You guess about 10 different shows. Just so we're clear. You don't get to guess 10 different shows and think you got it. <laughs> right? <laughs> I'm not even keeping score. If we were, I'd be winning. Favourite food? 
I don't think you'll guess mine. I think you'll get angry at mine, but I don't care. Dude, if you <laughs> if you say sausages, <laughs> I will. Do not say sausages. It's not sausages. One time she told me in one of these videos even, you said your favorite <laughs> food was sausages, yet you never even eat sausages. That was like the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. I do eat sausages, but that it's was not sausages. That was the dumbest thing. <laughs> the dumbest. Okay, thank God it's not sausages again. Uh, it's too hard because you have a food. You have a food. Can you name some? I can name some. Uh, you love bumcha? I do. What is it? Antipasto. I've decided that's my favorite food. I love it. I love it, antipasto. Chakota Ribard. <clears throat> you can't really say that though because it's, you don't ever say that that's your fave or anything. But I've decided it is because all the things <laughs> you get on antipasto are my favorite. Prosciutto's, I mean, for, 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 for the purpose of this video, you can't yeah. say that. It's I like, knew. I knew you know, the mad. other day I've just changed my <laughs> mind and I haven't told anybody. I've kept it entirely to myself. Well, yeah, I did. I knew how is mad. anybody supposed to know? But I knew you'd get mad. I'm not mad. Well, I'm just saying it. You can't include that. <laughs> Consider it that I'm just sharing a new fun fact about myself with you. All right. All right. Cool. <laughs> and yours is pasta. Yeah. Do you really leave? Is this how you clean your bone? Is this, would you throw this out? Can I just say, oh no. Would you throw this out? No, I would give it to you, oh but God. I'm just not liking the chicken. Biggest fear, biggest I don't fear. know yours. What's your biggest fear? I think it's obvious. It's oh, you, you, you hate the dark and ghosts and stuff. Oh, not ghosts, but I'm scared of the dark. Yeah. And that's my smaller fear. It's just like, I really, would hate to die in a way that was preventable. <sighs> so like, I'm really safe. I think you've told me that. Before, yeah, I'm like yeah. a safe person, you know? Yeah. I don't like to do things that like I could die. Well, here, here's a clue. It, yeah. my, my biggest fear has to do with death as well. Is it ghosts? No, I'm not really. That's what I wrote. Oh, it's not. If, if I had to name a fear, cause it's not usually something that like really scares me, but there was this one time when I had like a panic attack or something as a kid, right? Because I had this thought and the thought was that um, I'm, I die or that people think I'm dead and they bury me and then I wake up and I'm in a coffin and I'm like, oh, what the hell? That, that was my biggest, and I had like the biggest panic, like anxiety from that. I think I remember this. Yeah, cause I watched Ripley's Believe It or Not and it happened to somebody. <laughs> but back then, he, 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 he survived. Because on the coffin, for this, for this reason, they had these things at the, the, the end, right? And you kind of push it and it rings a bell. But if you're down, yeah. you can't, no one can hear the bell. No, the bell's up the top, I think. I, I was a kid, this is a childhood memory. So I could be making this up, but it was on Ripley's Believe It or Not. So being buried alive. Yeah, like that's why I'm very picky. If when I die, I want to be cremated. You gotta, you gotta make yes. sure I'm dead. Like yeah. you ain't surviving this, pal. You're not surviving being burnt up into ashes. Do not, do, hey, this is everybody that would take care of my death stuff. Do not bury my body whole. Do they even do that? I don't know, but make sure I'm cremated, please. I feel like yours is very like highly unlikely that it's gonna happen, but mine is like it really could. Happen. But that's that's fe that's fears. A lot of times they're like crazy Irrational. shit that might not. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, I have a what do you call it? A um, safety. No, what what do you call it? Like a what, a what do you call safe it? Safe word. No, you know those <laughs> things like a. <laughs> what. <laughs> Uh, a fail safe, a safe fail, fail safe. I don't know what you're talking about. Somebody knows what I'm talking about. Like, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> what is it? Describe what it is. Like, um, I'm really having a tough time. Yeah. All these words keep coming to me, but they're not quite right. Like, is fail safe not a thing? I don't, I've never heard it. it could a be. Fail safe. Fail safe. Uh, countermeasures, countermeasures. You know what I'm saying? No, I have measures in place okay. that would um, prevent my fear from happening. What's that? Being cremated? Being cremated. <laughs> you know, I'm not, I'm not going to be buried alive if I'm cremated. You know? Yeah. What if you're I've cremated counter, alive? I have countermeasures up and um, fail safes. But I don't know what fail safes is. 
What if you're cremated alive? Isn't that worse? No, I mean, no, no, it was. Man, did you just give me another fear? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna be cremated alive. How did, oh no, don't worry. Cause I was thinking to myself, like, if they try to cremate me, maybe I'll feel the burn. So I'll be like, hey, 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 stop burning me. I think but then, too late. <laughs> what if they chuck you into a thing and they close the door and they, oh, that's scary. I don't know how that works, but. You know what? Dude, just make sure I'm dead <laughs> if I die, please. If that's how, if you're buried alive or cremated alive, that's a preventable death. That's my fear too then, I suppose. Uh, we got similar fears. We share man. the fear. Do you like camping? You don't. What? You don't, you don't like camping. Yes, I do. Prove it. Prove it? You want me to prove How it? How many times have you gone camping? Like, when do you go camping? You want me to prove it? Do you, you own a tent? Hey, if, do you if, know how to if, put a tent hey, on? Hey, hey, if I prove you wrong, you have to smack yourself in the face 10 times on camera. How about that? Okay. How about that? How do you prove me wrong? We'll go camping and see who complains the most. I used to go camping every year with school camp. Thank you very much. I oh, so did everybody. Doesn't mean you like it. But I told you the other night that I never got to go anywhere as a kid. So going to camp was like one of the happiest moments of my year and I would yeah, but wait all year for it. Was it specifically camping or just the fact that you're going yeah, somewhere I love the, like a holiday? Yeah, camping. I, lo what do you I love loved about it. it. Do you pee, poop in a hole or in a toilet? We had, um, we, we stayed in cabins, so there was toilets. That's not camp. You didn't stay in a tent? I've stayed in a tent before. I've, I've stayed in a tent before. <laughs> what toilet what did you use? A toilet or a hole or uh, what? I would pee on trees and I didn't um, poo in. <laughs> <laughs> but there you go. You had to spank yourself 10 times. Nah. That's, that, what do you so, mean? I love- Have you used a camping toilet that smells so disgusting? Cause it's just a drop Danny? So your question is, do I like no, the smell asking, of poo? No, I'm trying to verify whether you've actually been camping or not. Yes, I've been camping. So what did the toilet smell like? Was it nice fresh? Well, did it flush we, or did it not? Well, all the kids actually had chores. So it would get clean because like, you would check the timetable and your cabin would be like on dinner prep or cleaning the toilets or something like that. So what toilets are they though? They're cubicles? Like what yeah, is- Yeah, they're like cubicles. Cause there's 30 kids and 30 kids got to brush their teeth and stuff. We had proper bathrooms. What, you just go camping the same place? Yeah. And it's only your school there? Yeah. Really? Yeah, my school owned that bit. I'm going to say that's not camping. Well, but we did camping stuff. Like obviously we had to have a base and then, you know, yeah, year seven, you do this, year nine, you do this orienteering shit, the eight, you do like this flying fox thing, like it's camping. It's camp, I love camping. I'm gonna say that's not real camping. You just don't wanna smack let's, yourself in the no, face 10 let's times. let's go real camping then and I'm gonna show you. I would you. be down, I would love that. I would too, but I don't know how because I've never done it on my own and I know that you don't know how to start a campfire. That's my type of thing though, like what I enjoy because I know it's not camping, but you know I've always wanted to do van life and like live on the road and stuff. And that was before all yes. the van life stuff popped up. I wanted to do this years and years and years ago. You see, to me, that's not my definition of camping. I'm talking about you pitch your own tent. It's freezing. It's fine, but you know, I like that kind of thing. So I do like camping. Okay, but not the kind of camping I'm thinking of. You gotta smack yourself 10 times Are you gonna on camera? answer if I like camping or not? Yes, you like camping. I do. <laughs> Come on, you gotta smack yourself in the face 10 times. No, no, you didn't prove anything. I do real camping, you don't do real camping. I did more outdoorsy camping no. stuff than you, mate. No way. Yeah. No way. I did orienteering in the forest. Did you have a shower? Was there showers there? I did like Boy Scout kind of stuff. Was there showers there? We had activities like that. You're, not, I did you're like, avoiding the question. I did like these crazy hikes and mud walks and all this kind of stuff. Excuse me? And we go, we one time we went fishing on the barge. What's so, a barge? <laughs> you obviously don't like camping. What's a barge? It's like a boat, like a big boat. So, was there showers? Yes, there were showers. Like cubicle showers? Yes. Okay, well my camping is you bathe in the dirty river. 
Because oh there's no showers God. in real camping. Dude, I went canoeing every year. I did more camping than you. Was there wildlife around? Yes. Dude, there was, oh, okay. dude, there was so much wombat shit everywhere. <laughs> Always. There was so much. Like we'd we'd have to um cross um like these massive open green fields. Mm. It was like it was like the ground was brown because there's just like wombat poo everywhere. Ew. Yeah, wombat, kangaroo, and all that. Yeah. There was a lot of wildlife. One time in our in our cabin there was a bat. Yeah. That's we, a joke. Is that real? Yeah. There's, yeah. And then we, we have to call the teacher and tell him there's a bat in my cabin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's real. I love how you say when I went camping there was a bat in my. Cabin, not tent. People have cabins when they go camping. Yeah, it's a thing. Yeah, but real camping is a tent. You never had to oh pitch. Have God. you pitched a tent in your life? Yeah, I have. I can't remember, but yeah, we had to do it once when we had to camp out once. When you had to camp out once, implying that the other stuff you did was not camping. Okay, <laughs> but I did. I did that. I, we spent a lot of time outdoors. There was heaps of animals, heaps of um ant ant nests. <laughs> In the bush, there's a lot of ant nests, like heaves, like he's a bull ant. I eat, I've eaten sugar ants before. Why? Because it's a thing you do when you're camping. <laughs> you eat sugar ants. Is it? Yeah, there's these, these sugar, you know sugar ants? I don't know, other people know sugar ants. Little but, ants? But there's, there's sugar ants. And um, my camp teacher got some in his hand and you just eat them. And the craziest thing, craziest, tastes exactly like sherbet. Oh, because it's sugar. <laughs> They're just called sugar ants. It tastes exactly like sherbet. Did you ever get those straws with sherbet in them? It tasted just like that. It was so weird. I've eaten a live ant before. Now, do you think I've been camping? No. I've eaten kangaroo before at camp. At camp, you ate kangaroo? That's right. What, did you no, no, hunt no. one? It was um, crocodile. I ate crocodile. Did you hunt it? No, the, I don't know why, but one of the teachers had some crocodile and I tried some. I, I I did I went I fished for some yabbies. Oh yabbying. Yeah, I went yabbying. Cool. Yeah. Catching your own dinner. Or did you eat I them? I don't think we ate them. I think, <laughs> we, I think we, we let them back into the thing, yeah. Oh, oh, should we move on to the next? There's only um there's two more. Okay. Favorite ice cream flavor? Yours? I don't know, strawberry? Yeah. Yeah. And yours is pistachio. Yeah, I don't really have one, but pistachio, sure. You know what, Owen? You're like giving me pity points or something. Yeah, because I know you'll just cry otherwise. No. You cried so much. You like time. pistachio? Oh, yeah. Okay. Gelato. Okay, sure, okay. sure, 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 sure. <laughs> Favorite probably would have been choc mint, which you should know, but. No, it is choc mint. Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> yeah, so there you <laughs> no, go. No, it is pity points. Yeah. Oh, man. And last question is your first car? Yours was the Hyundai Gets. And yours was a RAV4. Toyota. I'm gonna say. Yeah, I think it was, yeah. Green. The car was green. Yeah. Was it green? You think I had a green RAV4? Did they even make green RAV4s? Yeah, like a, a dark green. What color? Black? No, I didn't oh, have it. I didn't have a green RAV4. What color was it? It was red. No freaking way! <laughs> I swear. We both had a red car for our first car. Yeah. Can I, can, I, can I quickly tell a story about my camp? Because I wanted to say it, but then she- she's, I was gonna skip this question, you know? Because <laughs> okay, you, you wanted to rush and finish the other questions, but we're done with those two questions now. Is okay, that right? Okay, let's continue. Daniel's camp rant. It's not a camp rant. I just want to talk about a story I went camping once. Okay. So, so when we went camping, we used to play this game. When we went hiking, right? The teacher would like just out of nowhere, right? Yell ambush. And when that happens, you get 10 seconds, you go hide, and then they try to find you. And the one time he, he yelled ambush for hiking, and I was like, oh crap. So I quickly tried to find somewhere to hide. I didn't realize this, but I was on top of a bull ant nest. Have I told you this before? I think you told me this. I act surprised, but then I was like, no, I've heard this. Yeah, and then I looked down and there's like, my my shorts are covered in bull ants. I was so scared. I was like, what the hell? And I, I quickly brushed them all off and ran off somewhere. You gave your location away. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But oh, that's a fun that's story. Pretty, that's pretty campy. You don't get stories like that unless you went camping. Do you want to know you. a camp story of mine? 
was this boring it's ass not, story that no. you know anybody could have. Mine's it's, a real camp story. Okay, but it's you know. not as crazy. Go, go on. Right, go on. So every year, my family would go camping with three other families, right, and would kind of go to the same campsite, okay. same park. And we had, me and my sister had this little cash register toy and it had a key mm. and we took it camping. We weren't allowed toys at our camp. Well, this was not school camp, mine's real camp, okay? <laughs> and we lost the key, right? Mm. Key's gone. Come back next year, we found the key a year later. Mm. Like in the dirt. In this whole big park that you can camp in, we found the key. Is that not crazy? One year later. So basically, that that story that's that is pretty amazing, but that that doesn't have anything to do with camp. No, the only thing it has to do with camping is that it happened while we're camping. Yeah. But it's just that's my camp story. That's, that, that's I pretty, that is a cool story, but it's not a cool camp story. Mine's a cool camping story. I went camping. <sighs> Confirmed. You don't get stories like mine unless you went camping. Stories like that. That could happen anywhere. Actually, one time when I was camping, I drowned in the river. And my mum had to come save me. One time? That's a camping story. You don't even care that I nearly died. No, no, I, I got some, I got some, that almost happened to me too. <laughs> you one wanna one-up me? This, one up this, this one is one, <laughs> this, this is one up for you though. Um, we were canoeing already, uh -huh. that's already one up to you. Okay. And then our canoe capsized, right? So we went over and I was like trying to get up and then, but then the canoe went <laughs> right on my helmet here. So yeah. I was like struggling to get up, but then I did get up eventually. And then another time we are canoeing and there's winter on, oh my God, the water Ooh. is so cold. I've never been more cold. I've never experienced cold like that. And we, we capsized into oh, the no. freezing water and then we'll, I've never been that shocked. It was, it's like, um, I can't even describe it. It was so cold. And then I, me and my friends, we tried like grabbing onto like our teacher's canoe or something. <laughs> oh no, did you flip him? <laughs> so no, he didn't want uh, oh. he us to flip him. So he got his canoe <laughs> bloody, um, the, oar. the oar and whacked our hands. <laughs> so we would let go of his thing. Oh my God. <laughs> I know. <laughs> You're drowning. We weren't drowning, but uh, it was just, yeah. I went into shock almost. It was so cold. Yeah. I didn't realize how cold it was. Yeah. Well, that's a nice story. Yeah. One time at sailing camp, we capsized and you wear your life jacket, but the sail was like on the surface. Like I couldn't come up because the sail was there and it would like suck down in the water. And I was like stuck underwater cause I couldn't swim back under cause I had my life jacket on. I thought I was going to die, legit. Yeah, yeah, and then happens. also a girl um, dislocated her knee during that camp, and that was the last sailing camp my school did. They changed it. Because it was so dangerous, everyone would capsize and get injured. Just, <laughs> we just had canoes. I, I had a canoe camp as well. You know what, I think I've con <laughs> I've, I've proved to everybody that I, I went camping and I, I liked camping. Okay, I don't, I don't know. We should go camping. Do you want to go camping? I'll, I'll, I'll go it. camping. I'm down to go camping. You guys want to watch us go camping? We'll vlog it and we'll go oh camping. Oh my god, that could be really fun. That could be fun. Camp but vlog. Are we allowed to go with other people? Because like I have no camp equipment or I don't know what to do. I like it, but I never had to do anything. I don't You're know. You're talking to the number one camper in the world. So you know how to start a fire? 100%. You just Where get do you some get matches. The wood? Where's the wood come from? They're just... going to chop down the tree. Do you have a chainsaw? I'll just go down to Bunnings, buy some wood. It's all good. See. That's how I know your camping is not my camping. My camping, you chop down your own tree. No, we want like No, 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 no. You don't disturb the trees. You That's find a very the logs. no. No, we weren't allowed to. Because you're there with your school, of course you can't no. operate a chainsaw. No, no. When you go to the nature parks, okay, you leave nothing but footprints and take nothing but uh, pictures. pictures. You never went camping. Everybody knows that rule. Where did you get that from? What is it again? Leave yeah. nothing but footprints, take nothing but pictures. She didn't go camping. <laughs> you did not go camping. No, no, no. Who, who taught you that? What is that? <laughs> That's Nature Park 101. You don't, you know. No, well, I don't know if I was in a uh, nature park, a, um, what's it called? A preserved. Were you camping in like the city? No, but you could chop down the tree. No, I was in the outback, okay? I, I left camping. my key there. Okay, yeah. I think we've really proved you did not camp. Come!
Come on, man. You were taking the wood? No. Take nothing. Take nothing but photos. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Thank you very much for watching. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going back in my bucket. Oh, it's not a bucket. Do you know what, guys? When, when I said... When I said let's have $8 buckets, I thought of a pun in my head because we're playing this quiz. I was like, we're gonna have buckets of fun. And then they gave us a box and so my pun, I couldn't use my pun. Okay, bye everyone. Have, bye. A, have a fabulous rest of the day.